Hey ACL friends, Neil here. Uh, another odd position, but uh, laid on the um, floor at home. Just wanted to show you one last uh, exercise that you need to do. And I would probably, um, I would suggest maybe starting this, you know, kind of a month after surgery, something like that. And really what we're talking about here is for anyone who overpronates or has flat feet, um, what you'll find is that you didn't realize the amount of muscles that work in that foot to keep that foot stable um, because of its slightly collapsed arch. And what happens when you have ACL surgery and the time before and the time after where you're not moving around very much, those muscles actually waste away. So what that then means is that when you come to start doing squats and things like that and returning to your normal life, actually those muscles are no longer supporting the arch and you'll find that instead of squatting with your knee directly over your foot as you should do, you'll find that um, your knee will collapse inwards and you'll have a very unstable position and that's all because um, those muscles in your feet have stopped working on a day-to-day -day basis and your flat feet, uh, your overpronation is now going to be a problem for your knee. So what you need to do is an exercise to strengthen those muscles, keep them working, and I'm going to show you that right here. Um, so forgive me going out of camera, what I have is an elastic band which is tied to this coffee table and here comes the exercise. Very, very simple. Basically, lay down. Put your foot against the band, pull the band tight, uh, so this is a tight band. What's really important here is you don't let this knee rotate out and that you just move that foot resistance against the elastic band. Okay, this is another one of those exercises, if you can do it all day long, all the better. Uh, there's no real limit to what you should do. Keep this stable push against and that will keep those muscles working um, in the foot and bear in mind as well that because you've got um, hopefully two feet and you've been idle you're going to have overpronating problems on both feet you should work both as well turn around also put the resistance the other way and rotate inwards against the resistance. Do that on both feet and you'll get around one of the biggest problems. Uh, certainly something no one mentioned to me until you know uh, six months after, no more, nine months after surgery when you know, I was trying to do squats and you're trying to ski and you just haven't got that strength in your foot to keep your knee in line with uh, your ankle and the rest of your foot so as i say you cave inwards when you uh, when you do squats okay thanks very much uh until the next video uh be careful take care if you want to leave a comment ask a question please do so in the comment comment box below thanks a lot bye bye